Now let's go to the interior. <clears throat> so we could put up a picture like this. The interior of the moon uh, looks kind of like this. It's got the crust, okay? It's got the, uh, the lithosphere, which is kind of like our mantle, similar to Earth's mantle, the, but it's a lot colder, temperature 240 Kelvin. It's got silicon oxide. Then it's got a partially molten region, kind of similar to our uh, liquid outer core. Then it's got the core, okay? So crust, the side facing the Earth has a thinner crust, 65 kilometers. The opposite side has a, a wider, a thicker crust. So the side facing the Earth, much thinner. See, this is towards Earth. Remember how we were talking about the moon? You know, when we were talking about, uh, we, we said we only see one side of the moon. You see, the moon rotates like this. It'll continually face the same side. So now, if the Earth continually tugs on it, and the same side facing it, that means the interior of the moon has shifted towards us. You see? It's come towards us. So the side facing us has a thinner crust, much thinner. You see here? The opposite side is thicker. So that's called the, the far side of the moon, thicker crust, near side, thinner. Interesting, huh? Oh, let's see here. You see here, this is towards the, this is the interior towards the uh, moon. Now, what's going to happen when we talk about the surface, you're going to see, because the side facing us is thinner, when the molten region of the moon, there was lava flows in the past, and then it created what's known as the mare. The opposite side is too thick. So the lava just didn't make it all the way through, see? So uh, the opposite side of the moon, you, you don't see those things called mares. They only appear on the side facing us. Why? The crust is thinner. You see? The opposite side, the crust is thicker. And then here it says plastic asthenosphere, iron-rich core. You see, in the center. And then you've got view of the moon's south polar region. And you've got views of the moon's north polar region. <coughs> so you've got the lithosphere, this one here, similar to Earth's mantle, and is about 1,000 kilometers thick. So the temperature of it would be 240 Kelvin, very, very cold. And some of the things it contains, silicon oxide. Partially molten region, that would be this one here, the one in orange. That would be similar to our analogous to Earth's liquid outer core, but it is not liquid. It is about 500 kilometers. And then the inner core is about 238 kilometers. When you add up all this, this guy, this guy, this guy, you should, and then the crust, you should end up equal to the radius of the moon. Okay? Okay. 